Now to our other top story, a Johnston probate judge goes before a judge to face charges related to an alleged theft of collectibles from an estate. NBC 10's Allegra Zaymore is live outside of Superior Court with the details for us. Hey Allegra. And Tammy Priscilla Fasha de Mayo normally sits on the judge's bench, but today she stood as a defendant in a courtroom full of people as she faced charges for the role she allegedly played in the theft of valuable items from a Cranston man's estate. Johnston probate judge Priscilla Fasha de Mayo and her attorney refusing to comment after pleading not guilty to charges of attempting to obtain money under false pretenses over $1,500 and providing a false document to a public official. Sir, counsel, you want to wait the reading? Yes, Your Honor. A grand jury indicted five people, including DeMeo, for their roles in the alleged theft of sports cards and firearms from the estate of a Cranston man who died in 2021. The sports cards had an estimated value of $1 million, and the firearms were worth more than $100,000. DeMeo allegedly filed an application for approval of fees for work she claims she did on the estate. Prosecutors say those claims are false. Bail was set at $10,000 personal recognizance. Johnston Mayor Joe Policina Jr. released a statement saying DeMeo was immediately placed on leave and a final decision about her employment will be made once the case is resolved. And DeMeo's attorney will be filing a waiver of extradition request so she can visit her sister out of state and see clients. She's due back in court in October. Live in Providence, Allegra Zaymore, NBC10 News. Hi everyone, it's Mario Florio from NBC10. Thanks for checking out the NBC10 WJAR YouTube channel. Click the links on your screen for more stories from across southern New England. And don't forget, hit the subscribe button below and get notified anytime we post an update on YouTube. As always, thank you for turning to 10.